welcome in my messy, messy art space today, where I've just been practicing having a go at the um, boom, the boom stain gel. So this is a pre-made paint. Um, it does a number of things. I think it, you can stain surfaces with it. But the, the thing that it's really good for at the moment with the boom, bloom, uh, the bloom, Shelly Bloom technique, you know, going crazy in the art world, uh, is that it's a, a pre-made paint that you don't have to think about all the ingredients you put together. So I am just using this directly from the bottle. The only thing that I'm using different is a... Um, I'll use the Amsterdam paint with a bit of Floetrol pre-mixed as my cell activator and um, and the rest I'm just going to use the paint so if you only use a little tiny bit of this because it's really stretchy if the end of your paint is looking a bit just poke it out with a skewer so I'm going to poke these colours out I will explain the colours as I go along I, I guess is the easiest way um, so I'm doing that one that one that one and I'm gonna put some native violet purple which I love which is very strong so it kind of takes over everything if you don't be careful and I might add some pearlescent pink I will definitely tell you the colors as I go along now I am just using um, I could just use the boom gel sterling white but I'm, I'm just using this paint that I already have here and this is just the um, white house paint I'm not even sure what it was I don't normally use house paint but I'm told for this to turn out and have the better results you need to use the house paint so I'm not sure I have used other just paint mixed up with my acrylic and flow troll before and it, it's worked but obviously not as nice as some of the ladies are getting it but um you know just have a play with it so you only need a little bit of this paint so that's what i'm going to do today the supplier for the um, boom gel stain is capriol shabby chic and it ships worldwide so um you can order from the link below i do not get any um what you call it payment for it so i'm recommending only what i like to use okay is that enough let me see maybe a bit more so I've got it on this turntable which I've got this lollipop stick here um, let me see pour a bit more so I'll make sure I don't have to spin it out as far I guess um, I've got the lollipop stick on my spinner so um, make sure I can spin it now I probably should not I sh should be doing this in some kind of box so I'm just gonna squeeze it out into a circle instead of one just big blob there so that was the mana crab blue I am going to use the pearlescent pink Ooh. and then I will go the pearlescent dark blue dark blue yep yeah, pearlescent dark blue And then in between that, I'm going to put a bit of the native violet purple. I probably should stick to just a few colours, maybe. And what was the other one? Mali Ringneck Blue. And then I might go back to the pearlescent pink. I'll probably use way too many colours. So somebody slap my hand. All right, this is just the Amsterdam paint and flow troll. Well, 
the boom gel stain comes with a boom booster which I've used before but I'm not using today now I might just try my heat gun it might not work as a blower but I'll just give it a go nope don't work <laughs> this is the blower I've got my little blower there but I'll just try blowing it I think I've lost some, I've got no cell activator over there. <laughs> That's gorgeous, but not the rest of it. So I've done a boo-boo again. That is not celled because I obviously hadn't got enough cell activator, maybe. Who knows? So I didn't, I'm, I don't really want to get into the bloom hole because there's so many people doing it that can teach you. I just like having a go with this boom paint because it is just so easy and um, you haven't got to think about it. I think it's probably not good if you've got to put paint on afterwards. Oh well, I'm not gonna, oh, should I give that little bit of blow there? Whee! Probably should not have done that. Well, there you go, blowing obviously some of the white over the colours because the white has got the cell activator in it. But now I'm left with this hole. Maybe if I put a little bit, will it work or not? If I put a little bit of colour and then a little bit of cell activator maybe or not. That's gorgeous. I don't think I should have done <laughs> This is absolutely gorgeous. I suppose I should take a photograph of that while it's looking so gorgeous because I'm obviously going to lose it all when I spin it off. But here it goes anyway. It is very handy putting the lollipop stick, attaching it to your duva because it um, gives you a really good grip to spin it around. I absolutely love the colours, are so gorgeous. Wow, look at this. That is gorgeous. Very happy, Jen. Not happy with the center. I don't mind there being some parts that have not got all the things going on, but the colors are absolutely gorgeous. This is to die for. Well, it's not to die for. Nothing is worth that, but. <laughs> absolutely gorgeous just i don't know what's going on here help me somebody what am i supposed to do here it is okay to have a little bit of negative space like that i quite like that there love that I, i've lost it a bit in the center but a little it's better than the last one I did and the sides are gorgeous. So I'm quite happy with that. I will um, bring the camera down and let you have a little looky and see what you think. The colors are gorgeous.
love the colour, so I will try it again. But um, I'll bring the camera. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. Sorry about the reflection. That's gorgeous there. So as you've seen, I didn't have to do anything or mix in all these products together or, you know, just go for it. And obviously the more you do it, the you don't have to be the same as everybody else's. It's um, still gorgeous, even though the negative space is not, is filled with that fine webbing. So it is very nice. I'll show you the sides. Look at this, that's cute. Don't know what to do about that hole there, but look at this side, it's gorgeous. It's nice. It's a no-brainer. Uh, it is a bit odd, like the composition is not real good. The colors are stunning. And I know that if I put resin on that, that either to gift it or it will, you know, somebody will love it. So I'm gonna leave this one just as it is um thank you so much for joining me on this uh, crazy little boom gel journey um and until tomorrow where there will obviously be another pour because i pretty much do one every single day thank you so much for joining me you take care people and enjoy enjoy your art or enjoy watching so until tomorrow bye for now